In this video, we're going to go over some of the features of Tube Mini. I have Tube Mini in red color here, but it is also available in blue color, black, and silver. On the side of Tube Mini, there is a button and also a slider switch. The button in the center is a pause and play button, which can interact with your music player, such as a tablet or a phone. The output switch is labeled SE, which is single-ended, unbalanced, or BL, which is balanced. On the front of Tube Mini, there are two outputs. On the left side is a 3.5 millimeter standard headphone jack, which is unbalanced. It is labeled SE for single-ended. On the right side is the 4.4 millimeter balanced output, which is also known as Pentacon, is labeled BL for balanced. On the opposite side, there are two buttons. On the left side is the volume up button. On the right side is the volume down button. If you hold either of these buttons, you will enable the skip functionality. Skip to the next track, go back to the previous track of your music. We do recommend whenever possible to use the volume buttons on your music player to reduce physical contact with the Tube Mini, thus minimizing the micro vibrations. On the top of Tube Mini, there is a window showing you the vacuum tubes. We use traditional vacuum tubes. This is an old technology similar to using vinyl records. Some care is required to achieve the best results. On the bottom side of Tube Mini, there is a USB-A male connector. This is a universal connector, so you can easily use adapters to convert to your favorite device, such as Apple Lightning or USB-C. Or if your computer or tablet has a USB-A port, you can simply connect Tube Mini directly to your computer. On the front of Tube Mini, there is an LED light that shows the incoming sampling rate of your music. Green for CD quality, amber for high resolution, and yellow for master quality authenticated, also known as MQA. If you have any questions, feel free to give us a call or send us an email, and we'll try our best to answer your questions. Thanks for watching, and we'll see everyone in our next video.